the lemur is no longer missing. The endangered animal turned up in a surprising spot tonight as the mystery grows over who stole him and why. Maki, no longer missing. Tonight, the lemur is home safe at the San Francisco Zoo. It's a story we first broke on Twitter last night. But how did the primate end up on the peninsula? Well, he was spotted this evening at a Daly City preschool some five miles from the San Francisco Zoo. Check out the map. It's a distance. Tonight, the search for continues for who stole the lemur. NBC Barry's Ian Cole is live in Daly City. And Ian, you spoke to one of the men who first found Maki. Yeah, and you can imagine it was quite the shock. He was just picking up his daughter from preschool here at the Hope Lutheran Church and School uh, when he parked his car, got out, and then one of the kids shouted, Lemur. He then took a quick look and noticed, hey, that's the one that's been missing. Tonight, Maki the lemur is safe. Seen here in a cage moments after he was captured on a Daly City preschool playground. All of the kids were thrilled to see him up close. He was first spotted by one of the kids in front of Chris Lee's car around 5 p.m., apparently eating from a bush. We spoke with Lee by phone. I anticipate that you will show up in the, in the, in the, at the school. But if you think of the, if you think of the Pennsylvania Daily City and the SF Zoo, it's pretty close. He says Maki, who was an old lemur, was moving slowly. He wasn't aggressive and didn't seem to feel threatened either. Lee and other parents called 911 and animal control. That's why I called them and said, hey, um, we found your limber. Daly City police came in minutes and contained Maki until staff from the zoo came and trapped him before bringing him back. Police say Maki was stolen from the San Francisco Zoo overnight into Wednesday. They found signs of forced entry at his enclosure and are still looking for suspects. Right now, it's not clear how Maki ended up here. But for Chris Lee and the kids, it was a show and tell they'll never forget. A very good experience for my kids to, to see the limb of the first time physically, but not in a zoo. <laughs> Yeah, and Lee also joked it's just another day in 2020, finding a lemur at your daughter's preschool. Now, there's some more good news to share as well. The police say that the lemur uh, is uh, appears to be in good health. So tonight, many kids, zoologists, animal lovers across the Bay Area nation really happy that Maki is back home. We're live in Daly City, Ian Cole, NBC, Bay Area News.